alaikum. My name is Zahra Bilu and I'm with CARE San Francisco Bay Area. We're on the Woo! best coast Woo! in the country. When my parents migrated to America in the 70s, they became more religious because they understood that in this country, the First Amendment would practice, would protect and celebrate their practice of their faith. They raised their kids as proud American Muslims who knew that we could pray where we wanted to and dress how we wanted to and eat what we wanted to whenever, because this was home. In November of 2016, we got this president whose name may have been said on this stage, but I won't close out with it. He did not bring us into the America that my parents came to. He gave us something entirely different. He said that he wanted a complete shutdown of Muslims like my parents and like many of yours from coming into this country. But on January 28th, 2018, as thousands of you poured into airports and helped file lawsuits and feed and cheer on impacted people, that once again was the America that made my parents more religious, that made my parents know that they could raise their kids free from any fear for their safety. We see that again out here today. We saw it with all of the impacted people in the courtroom, the Somalis, the Iranians, the Yemenis, and others who said, we want the justices to see the faces of the people who are being banned. And we see it with all of you out here in the rain, saying that America at its best welcomes immigrants. America at its best does not discriminate against people based on who they pray to or for or how. America at its best includes impacted community members standing courageously to speak truth to power against white supremacy when it comes from the White House or anywhere else. And America at its best includes allies who step forward and say, how can we be of service? So on behalf of CARE and its 35 chapters, on behalf of Asian Americans Advancing Justice and its affiliates, and the National Immigration Law Center, I am humbled to stand here with all of you outside of the Supreme Court, knowing that whatever may come from the justice's decision, that we are stronger when we stand together. And that this fight, though long, is not one that we're in alone. We will win because truth and justice are on our side. So thank you all so much for being here and for continuing to work with us as part of the No Muslim Ban Ever campaign. Say it with me, No Muslim Ban Ever. No, no Muslim Ban Ever. No ban. No ban. No wall. No wall. No raids. No raids. No ban. No ban. No wall. No wall. No raids. No raids. Because I can't get free until we're all free. Thank you so much. Woo!